good evening to all of you in this particular video presentation i'm going to explain how our one standard deviation weekly trend has performed in this week so this is ranjan from smart finance and every week we are releasing this trend report most of the week we are releasing the trend report of nifty and bank nifty using our one standard deviation software so here too also i have given from the 27th november to 3rd december so we have released on 27th of november so before that it is being released so it was valid from 27th number november to 3rd december so these calculations how it has performed that i am going to explain in this particular video so you have seen that nifty from 20 so 29th to the 3rd december in fact so 27th we have released that on saturday and 28th was holiday and monday onwards it was bad so you can say here here these levels has triggered on monday 16850 was low and 17093 so it was the opening basis itself this low is being created second day 30th november also a very trouble day though it has made a good move 17,350, but it failed to maintain there, and from there it has slipped, and 17,037 it has blocked. And first December also it has moved. Anyhow, it has maintained in the upper band. Today also it was a great day. So how far our calculation has fared? That I want to show you here. So the first trading day, so it has been released on 27th of November. So when the Nifty was 17,032 level. So you can see 16,850 low is being created on the first day. So I used to say that this is the reversal zone. So we have kept a color for this reading. So here you can say this has perfectly validated on that day and it has closed in 17,094 levels. So this 17,094, it just confirm your uptrend. That was the actions on Monday, Monday closing, it was very close near to that. So Tuesday, it has gone till 17,350. So 350 level. So you can say that it has almost crossed the first targets this level and a couple of points above it has gone. However, it has fallen down 17,036 it has closed 17,036 it has closed so what we have seen here 17,037 was the last traded price so though it has made 17,347 so here to also this calculations is partly the high was 20 points above this price points and it has maintained so what happened the yesterday the first december it has made 17250 high and 17235 was the closing so 17250 was the high again it has proved that it is the first cycle first cycle here so 10 point above it has gone and 235 very close near to this level only it has closed however only one best part of yesterday's price action was there. It has closed above the 0.786 retracement. So which is very critical. If the price maintains above there and close there, then there is a hope of uptrend and uptrend should continue. So this is what happened. And today's day is very, very interesting day. So today Nifty levels, if you can see, it is very, very interesting day and it has uh, It has worked perfectly today and if you just look into today's nifty all are future values so all these values what we have given so all are the future values nifty future values so today nifty future values if we can see we'll find out that it has 
perfectly maintain a sequence there 417,444 so 400 444 level it has gone so that too also again above the hurdle zone of this 17,364 to 403 so this is the hurdle zone so it was quite with some time and most part of the day today which is I am recording today 2nd of December it was struggling in this level so once it given, given a breakout above this so it has closed near to that and the more interesting part of today's price actions will be on the most interesting factor of today's price actions will be on the level of the high and the low so you can just have a look here so today what was the high it has created it has created a high of 17,444 low 17,170 it has opened at 17,205 and closing or last traded is 17,440 so have a look at this 17,170 how important it was so your first cycles this level 17,177 though yesterday first of December it has closed above that but today it has tried to break it but it could not sustain there and from there it has moved on and it has closed 17,439 just 10 point above our point triplet calculation level and it has gone to 444 so this is how it has fared so it is though it is important to see the targets however it is very very important to know the method used in this particular calculations how true it will be you can say that 16,000 850 low on the first day of monday it is a weekly level we have created 17850 with low again 17094 closing on the same day on monday and again it is tuesday tuesday it is going to a level of or you can see here this is the monday action 29 so again 30th action is 17000 17,347. So Tuesday's action also was very interesting action. So here 17,000 it has come. So these two also low of Tuesday was 17,000. Then it has it is closing at 17,347. So here high happened 17,347. And there is a diff correction post that and it is settling at 17,000. 037 so which was our exactly at our reference price or the friday's closing so it is none of our calculated points so you can say it is it has happened in this order and you can say on the day of wednesday 17000 again 17100 low so 100 low very close near to your buying level it has come then it has maintained 17,250. So, all these days price actions I am writing here. So, 250 and closing at 17,235. This is on the Wednesday's price action. Today's price actions, if you can see, it has gone to a low of today's price action or Thursday's price action is 17,170 was the low. Then it has made 17,000. 17,444 was the high and 39 it is closing 17,439 so all these numbers if you can link it with our calculated numbers you will find out that how closely market is accepting these readings and this has not happened on today 27th of November itself this calculation happened and with a small deviation of 10 to 5 points, how the market is accepting these levels. Similar thing also we have given in the Nifty. Similar thing also we have given for the Bank Nifty. Bank Nifty also performed in the same scale. So that too also you can check on. So this is the 
actual success of this particular product. Suppose if you want to test this product, we do have two editions here. One is the monthly edition, another is the yearly edition. So you can procure this product by visiting our site under the product link. So monthly edition hardly cost you 600 rupees. So yearly edition cost you 6,500 rupees. So this is how you can, and the software has lot many features with it. So it has an option scanner, it has it. So you can able to do equity analysis, you can do all kinds of option weekly analysis, option monthly, option scanner. So very, and commodity also you can trade and you can also trade in the equity, stock future, index future, currency future. So all these segments you can able to trade in this particular or using this particular tool. So if you have any product related query, feel free to call in these numbers, which is reflecting on this screen. Do share this video with your friends. And if you like, please give a like in this video. Thank you very much. Thank you for your time.